So I just got finished sprinting up this hill about 10 times. And the funny thing is I enjoyed it. Now, the most common mistake I see people make when they approach exercise is that they only want the result. They only want to lose weight. They only want to stay healthy. So that makes them resort to doing an exercise like walking on the treadmill for 20 minutes or biking on one of those stationary bikes for 20 minutes. Now the problem with this is, is that you are gonna burn out. I've seen this happen with people that I actually know they got like the Peloton bike and they paid the $50 a month, but it was just a stationary bike that had like some videos that you could play along with. It was, it was just boring. You were sitting inside your house biking on a bike when you could have been outside. Now, ideally we should take an approach to exercise that, okay, what do I want to do? Not what will give me the result. When we think about what will you enjoy, what will you enjoy doing? Then you will actually win the long-term game. You will not give up on that exercise for the next 20 years, 10 years, if you choose the right one. If you wanna be good at tennis or if you enjoy playing tennis, you won't stop playing tennis because you just like doing it. But if you just wanna, if your goal is to lose weight, or on the other hand, if your goal is to just stay healthy, and you choose to walk every day inside for maybe 20 minutes on the treadmill, that's so much more harder because you just don't enjoy the walking. You're only walking for that end goal. Whereas with like the, the sport that you love doing, where like for example, tennis, you actually enjoy playing that sport. So that's a very key mindset shift that you need to make if you haven't. And uh, just choose a sport that you actually enjoy doing. Don't just do one that is projected to give you a longer lifespan or lose you more calories. Because whatever you do, eventually over the long run, you are gonna lose calories. You are gonna lose a lot of weight if you keep this up for the next 20 years. Don't just make your exercise boring by walking inside for 20 minutes every day. Or like, I don't know, doing some pull up, push up, back day routine. And something that makes exercise even more fun is competition. So if you could find a group of people who are around your level to compete with in maybe tennis or whatever sport we're gonna say you like doing, maybe it's hockey, running. For me, it's running, I love running. So I'm around a bunch of guys who are on the same level as me for running. Most of them are a little bit faster, but it's a great way to actually push yourself when you have that competition. Now, in order to find the sport that you enjoy doing or the exercise activity that you enjoy doing, you need to experiment. You need to find out what you enjoy doing. You have to look at all these different sports. You have to like unlock these new achievements. If you've ever played like Minecraft and you do something new for the first time and you see that achievement pop up, you need to do that for all these different sports, okay? So right now, I want you to take the first step and choose the sport that I'm about to tell you. Just go outside and run. This is the most simple sport there is, and it's the most, I find it really enjoyable because running, it, it releases endorphins in your brain, and uh, it, it just makes you feel so good like after you run. It gives you the same effect as being high on drugs. I've never been high on drugs, but according to like some scientific research, the endorphins that get released in your brain are equivalent to that of the dopamine released by like methamphetamine. But yeah, go outside and run for t five minutes, five to 10 minutes, and then come back and see if you actually like doing that. Maybe you won't right now, but if you keep doing it and keep doing it and getting better, you will get better at it. You will get, it'll be easier to run. So take that into account as well, because the more you get better at something, the more you enjoy doing it. That's why you probably enjoy doing things that you're already good at. That's why I'm a runner, because it's like the best sport that I am good at. Before you go on that run, I want you to look for some place that you've never been before and just run there, just run there. Just explore it, like unlock a new, uh, you know how the map in video games is like black before you ever enter it? It's like in the shadows, it's unlocked, it's locked. I want you to go unlock a new part of like your local map. You probably haven't visited like everywhere in your maybe three, four mile radius. So just find a new place. That's just gonna make the run more fun for you. You're like unlocking new territory of your actual home. For example, this is the first time I've ever been in this place. There's a bridge right there and it's along a hill that I sprinted up like 10 times at the beginning of the video. And 
I've never been here before. I'm definitely gonna come here a lot for sprinting up that hill because it was actually really fun. But yeah, just find new places. And if you have that sense of adventure every day, you've solved your problem of getting the exercise done because you just want to do it. Just make the exercise enjoyable and you will do it anyway, okay? So remember this, don't focus on the end result, focus on the process itself. All right, my name is Fars Faisal, I'm out. Follow the Instagram down below, think big. I just noticed there's some creepy ass van right here and I was just walking right by it all alone, bro. That's actually kind of scary.